we're back we're in the closet boom okay so today we're talking about affirmations a form oh no affirmations affirming ourselves and for some reason recently i think it's kind of been a trend i don't have tiktok but i believe it's been a trend on tiktok and things about oh affirmations manifesting abundant life okay this is not a trend this is real so this i'm not making this video as part of a trend no i'm making this video as part of real life stuff you know affirmations and things it's real and it really is important and it does help you and it is a huge part of changing and transforming your life Let me make sure I'm, the mic is on so this has nothing to do with like those little videos that you see about these that's fine but you need to understand that this is real so i know it's real because it's been something that i'm always hearing about as i'm learning as i'm on this journey of um, improving my life and improving the person that i am and reaching my maximum potential and my abundant life i'm always hearing about affirmations and how important it is um and it's important the way we speak to ourselves sometimes we don't realize how important it is but the way you speak to yourself and the way you speak about yourself matters so i have been more cognizant of that so even when you're just joking and saying oh i'm so dumb oh i'm just so lazy or i'm just not in shape i have gotten to the point where i don't say anything negative about myself i don't say anything negative about myself to myself or to other people and i don't let anybody around me speak down on themselves either no, it's not happening because when you are constantly telling yourself those negative things that are coming from a place of lack, you'll always operate from that mindset. Not even, oh, you'll always attract that back into your life. That's true as well, but you'll always be operating from that mindset. And that's the whole point of abundant living is the opposite of that. You want to speak from an abundant way of looking at yourself. So an example is, let's say personally, I am not in the best shape that I could be in. So I'm not going to walk around saying I'm not in shape. I'm overweight. Or that's just an example. But, you know, I'm not in shape. I can't even do uh, a push up. You know, I, I can't even run, you know, half a mile. I can't even walk a few miles. I am just so out of shape. I won't say that. I'll say, you know what? I am constantly every day becoming more fit i am constantly every day becoming strong becoming um healthier i'm becoming you know looking the best that i can that's what i would tell myself let's say another example you're somebody who um you think that you're lazy you think that you have no energy you think you're lazy you think you're lethargic and you think that you just procrastinate don't sit don't sit there and tell yourself oh my gosh i'm such a procrastinator Oh my gosh, I'm so lazy. I just, I'm just so tired. I just don't feel like doing anything. Don't do that because all you're doing is just perpetuating that message even more. You're telling yourself I'm lazy. Your mind believes you're lazy. You're telling yourself that you're, that you have no energy. Then your mind thinks you have no energy. Your body is now going to respond to that thought of saying, well, you thought that you had no energy. So now you literally have no energy and all you want to do is lay in the bed. But that's no, that's a trick of the mind. What you need to do is you need to say, I, you know, I, I'm energetic. Just say, say what it is that you want to attract. Say I'm energetic. You need to say it. You need to write it down. You need to say it when you wake up and when you go to sleep and throughout the day and you need to write it down and read it. I am energetic. I am full of life and energy. I am working towards my goals. I am not a procrastinator. I believe in um, getting stuff done. I am very proactive. I take initiative. Speak about yourself in a positive light. And the other thing is too, like I kind of mentioned before, we know even when my friends are kind of just joking like oh i'm so dumb or i'm i'm this if it's not positive i say no you're not no you're not don't ever say that about yourself because you know your mind doesn't know the difference between you're joking because it doesn't matter you joking and you being for real it doesn't matter you said it you said it so it's already out there now you know um so constantly tell yourself I tell myself, look, I'm intelligent, I'm bright, I'm kind, I'm grateful, I'm giving, I'm amazing. I tell myself the best thing that I wanna be, I tell myself that I'm already that already. Um, but I wanna give you guys some examples. So first off, I don't even have my other phone in here, but I you know, was reading through Pinterest and I found an affirmation little 
wallpaper thing and I set it as my screensaver and I also made an Instagram caption but it says I'm a visionary I should know it <laughs> I look at it every day I'm a visionary what I see with my heart I will see with my eyes it's something like that um, that's you know that, that speaks to me because all of, all the things that I see with my heart you know with business and my channels everything I'm gonna you know I'm gonna I'm gonna that's gonna happen I'm gonna see it with my eyes it's in my heart I'm gonna see it but uh, I started getting a little bit more serious with my manifestations well first before I even get into that um, this was about like a year and a half ago um, when I was really first starting my journey of just becoming the best Nicole becoming the best me um, but this is not about me it's also about you and I um, was listening to one of my life coaches Tony Gaskins and he recommended you know he honestly, he honestly just said it um, to basically um, speak some positive affirmations over yourself, record it and like play it back every morning. So I have one. I have one. Um, I can kind of remember it just says I am beautiful and it says I'm grateful for this day. I'm beautiful. I'm kind. I'm smart. I'm intelligent and I'm capable of the things that I deserve and things that I have worked for. Um, it says. I will, I'm, I'm going to reach and teach millions of people and I'm going to always work on my, the three B's that Tony Gaskins talks about the um, brain, brand, body, and then the five F's. But I think it's like faith, family, fun, friends, finance. I had that and I used to listen to it. I want to make a new one. But in the meantime, I've kind of just been every morning that I, that I remember, I'm not going to lie. It's not every morning, but when I'm really trying, I write down my affirmations, basically just things that I want to be for that day or for that season or for that week or things that I'm working on. So I only have a page of three, but when I first started doing this, like this is from three mornings. So the first day that I did this was about two weeks ago and I just, I wrote four. As soon as I woke up, I said, I am grateful for this day. I always start off by saying I'm grateful for this day because that's a, you know, that's a, that's an attitude of gratitude and that's just the best way to start your day. That's the best way to think when you're starting your day is to just be grateful for the day. So I said, I'm grateful for this day. I'm radiating with energy and life. I am beautiful, kind, and social. I am accepting of new relationships. So I put like beautiful, kind. Now social is something different. I said that I, you know, I affirm that for myself because that's something that I struggle with a little bit. You know, I've already talked about my social anxiety, um, but I, I do actually have the goal of being more social but at the end of the day i just want to be myself and so however that being social is going to manifest throughout me then it's me being myself so then the next time that i did this i said i am grateful for, i'm grateful for this day again i am radiating with energy and life did i just write the same ones okay i'm radiating radiating with energy and life so again that's me talking about like i said before being energetic you know not being lethargic but being energetic and just full of life um i am stylish fashionable and gorgeous i've been working on my style and putting outfits together is kind of like my new favorite hobby and i just love that i love you know researching chic aesthetics and outfit ideas so i like thinking of myself as as you know okay she can dress um i am extremely benevolent so i wrote that just so that i can work on being kind and giving and making sure that the people i encounter they feel that energy from me they understand that i'm willing to help them and then this is actually the last block of affirmations are the ones that i wrote today this morning because i knew i was filming this video so i had to do it today i said i am grateful for this day again i am healthy and energized i am financially responsible and i am pleasant and kind to those that I encounter um, because today I'm going you know ooh, we encounter people every day but we want to have that pleasant and kind energy and I said I'm financially responsible because that's what I'm working on now I just transitioned to another journey another chapter in life you know being independent having to pay for a lot of things on my own which I love I love being independent being financially independent being able to uh, basically you know spend my money how I want to but got to be responsible about it Got to be responsible. Don't be, you know, don't want to just be throwing money away, but being responsible with my money. And I just, I love that, that, that affirmation for me, because that means a lot to me. I just want to remind you too, that I want to remind you that the way you speak to yourself matters. And I know that it's human nature to look at our flaws and to say, dang, you know, I'm just not enough. I'm just, I'm overweight. I'm not at the weight I want to be. 
you know, I'm, I'm sad, I'm angry, I'm just hurt. <laughs> Uh, but but don't do that. Don't operate like that. You have to say, no, I'm healed. I'm not hurt. I am healed. Okay. I am happy. I am just grateful. I am. I'm just everything that you want to be because it's personal to you. Everything you that you want to be, speak it. Why not speak it? Why not? You know, why not? Because the only reason that you got to where you are now is because of what you spoke and what you, you know, what you consumed and you got, you got to change that up. So that you can become better i like this to be in the video okay that is why it is important that we have an idea of what our dream life looks like or if you don't like that terminology just you know at the best you what does that look like for you physically mentally spiritually all of the leaves that's what you need to be affirming all the time every day whenever you get a chance so that's why all that financially responsible social all of that that is part of who i am aiming to become so that's why that is part of my affirmations so you know your affirmation should be who it is that you're aiming to become and just the best version of you it, it's it's so simple though like it's so simple and i think it's something that it's important. It's, it's so, um, what's the word I'm looking for? It's so critical in our self growth as individuals, but it's not something that, you know, we really sit down and, and learn, but it's easy. And I just told you about it. So I recommend doing it and remember as well, you know, you want to speak positively to yourself, but also speak positively to others, but you'll do that anyway, because if you're speaking positive positively to yourself, you know, you'll only have that positivity to, to spread to others. You won't even have it in you to say anything negative to anybody else around you. But remember that too, because you know, whatever you put out there, it's gonna come back, you know, to you. These affirmations, like these affirmations got me lit. <laughs> these affirmations are just so beautiful and, and just amazing and they're great. And you have to just, and, and, and don't think of it as being cheesy, just, say who you are and say who you want to be and, and you will be that person um but you know these affirmations they help you they're going to help you change the way that you think change your thinking patterns you know it's going to get rid of all those negative thoughts because the negative thoughts the negative thinking patterns is going to just cause anxiety and then the anxiety is going to just cause depression and then you're going to be confused so that's why these affirmations will calm all of that they're gonna block the negativity out. A lot of times it's hard to block out negative thoughts when life just hits us and we have all of these negative ruminating thoughts, but just don't pay attention to them. Just change your thought. Just say, you know what, like, let, like let's say whatever you are, like I said, say the opposite. So if, you're, if you feel like you're worrying or stressed, say, you know, I, I, I have my faith in God. I trust in God. I trust in God's plan. I, you know, am worry free i am stress free i am faithful you know i have faith in my journey i let go and i let god you have to speak like that and think those things because like i said human nature is going to bring us down like the devil will bring you down the devil wants you to think negatively the devil wants you to think that you're always going to be in the position that you are where you're unhappy where you're not that best version of yourself but no no affirmations are one of the biggest steps in changing your life so that's why it's important so affirm yourself as much as you can write down affirmations repeat them and just the main takeaway please always speak positively about yourself don't ever speak negatively even if it's just a joke even if you're just kidding even if it's just not serious to you your brain doesn't know the difference so be more cognizant about what you're speaking over yourself and others and you will see your life change. Thank you. I hope that you found this affirmations video helpful. I hope you incorporate this into your life and get started writing those affirmations and I'll see you guys.